Hi, I'm Katherine Roberts from Yoga for Golfers. And I'm Doug Hammer, Director of Instruction at True North Golf Club. I want to talk to you today about how you can create more distance in your game by using the ground. Catherine, another common thing that I see in the golf swing is people get stuck on the outside of the right foot and they can't use the ground properly to push off of and help them create power in the golf swing. Makes sense. A lot of times in the backswing they'll, they'll really uh, slide to the right, they'll get to the outside of the foot and consequently they, they can never get going back forward. Uh -huh. So a common drill that I do is, is I stick a head cover on the outside of the right foot, or a back foot for, for any golfer. Yep. and help them feel like their weight is staying on the inside of that foot. So is there anything else? it gives them a frame of reference of something to push against? Correct, correct. Yeah. And, and that's what would initiate the downswing yes. is pushing off of that back foot yeah. to go forward. That's a great drill. I love it. One of the things that we see in yoga for golfers very often with our athletes is that golfers very often have flat feet. So what does that mean? That means that not only has the arch fallen, but there's typically a, a right so the whole foot rolls in yes. it would be impossible to create that motion that you just talked about when everything is collapsed yes right? absolutely so I want to just show you two exercises that you can do to even just bring some awareness motion uh, flexibility and strength to the feet and the arches and even if you have flat feet trust me you can work on this okay good, so good. the first thing would be to just stand with your feet right underneath right underneath your hips okay so not too wide just about here and with the club as support, simply rise up as high as you can onto your feet and then let the heels come down. So lift up high okay. and let them come down. You can do that 15, 20 times, 25 times, and you'll start to feel at least some range of motion in the arch. The other one is to step the right foot forward and the left foot back. Actually, I'll switch legs. Step the right leg back. And what you do is, again, standing nice and tall, lift the heel high, hmm. right? Press yes. the ball of the foot into the ground and then press the heel down, okay? So Great. you can practice both of these drills and you'll start to get more range of motion in your feet, which will help you to be able to execute that leverage from the ground. Excellent, excellent. Visit my website at yoga4golfers.com and truenorthgolf.com. And on both of our websites, you'll see a schedule of golf schools where you can personally experience golf instruction and fitness instruction together at True North. We look forward to seeing you soon.